Hi. Um, according to uh, Islamic tradition, or yeah, uh, Muhammad, according to well, in, in Quran seventeen one, uh, in Quran seventeen one, well, you know, Muhammad took a uh, journey from uh, Mecca to Medina, in a journey by night, and in the Hadith, you know, he took a, a flight, he took a journey by night from Mecca to Medina on a on a on a winged uh, human headed donkey like creature with a peacock tail and he visited the Al Aqsa Mosque and the, the Temple of Solomon even though those two structures never existed at the same time in history but it says he visited them and then he took that flying creature with the human head and the tail of peacock up into heaven where he listened to Musa and was able to talk all it down from 50 prayers a day to the current five. And he wanted to do it more, but he thought, no, no, no. Uh, he, he didn't want to bother all eating more, so he just kept it at five. Yeah. Of course, he does say one hour seeking knowledge is better than seeking... Uh, one hour... Seeking knowledge for one hour is better than praying for 70 years. So maybe... Yeah, maybe he's going against Allah for even having five hour, five prayers a day now. But anyway, according to tradition, that donkey thing with the human head and a tail peacock, before it flew up in heaven and left a hoof print on the dome on a rock uh, that used to be where the the Jews used to sacrifice uh, sin offerings and blood atonement uh, using innocent animals. Uh, for sin offerings and stuff, as, according to the the Torah, which the Quran says is all this book given to Musa, and that hoofprint supposedly can be seen. Well, guess what? I looked all over the internet, looking all the pictures, images of uh, the dome of the rocks, rock, and I couldn't find any arrows pointing to any hoofprint, which is a shame because you know if they could find it, it'd be like the new Shroud of Turin. You know, if you think Shroud Turin gets a lot of views, can you imagine if they actually saw a hoof print on the dome, uh, on the rock, in the dome of the rock, you know? But anyway, I found the best picture ever, and I'm going to show it to you and see if you can find a hoof print, okay? All right. Okay, here. All right, let's see if I can find it. Ah, here it is, yeah. Okay. All right, here's some... Uh, Carp, here's some uh, rugs, uh, probably prayer rugs for the Muslims. And, yeah, and this is a, a, a column here, but this is the big rock here, big rock here. And um, there's a there's a hole dug into the rock, and another one, and some carvings. Uh, apparently, the the rock can be carved, as you'll see. There's a lot of carvings in it, uh, a lot of. Uh, uh, a lot of straight lines carved into it. It can be carved, apparently. And this looks like a footprint, but it's actually, I think it's just a shadow from the sun coming in. And there's some shadows, you know. May not be a footprint that's carved in there. Could be just a shadow from uh, the, this rock here or something like that. And anyway, here's a. Uh, that looks kind of like a footprint, too. I don't know. Uh, this looks like a giant footprint then sunk in here but anyway if you can find a hoof print and it have to be a hoof print even even though the thing had the head of a, a human you should be able to saw, find a hoof print because because they say hoof print so that so that leaves this this footprint out and that footprint out yeah and this is this is too big to be a hoof print unless that thing was a giant monster, you know, a giant. I mean, yeah, that's kind of like a hoof print, but that'd be huge, gigantic thing. So anyway, but if you want to uh, get a better picture, since I and I I dropped my camera, and it's all white as far as the monitor goes, so I don't know if that's going to show up very well or not, but if uh, it didn't look very well, you can go on the internet, type in uh, Dome of the Rock hoof print, and look for images and see if you can find the image, the foot, the footprint 
in picture form of the Albarock thing, you know, the flying donkey-like thing with the head of human, and tell Peacock. You know, so uh, maybe you can do your own little search up here. Okay, bye.